Hey guys, Gold Bullion Treasures here. It's drizzling outside. It's 43 degrees according to that. 44 according to that one. Ooh, a little dusty. Alright. In my car. About to work on this mess. I don't know where to put this at so you guys can see what I'm working on. If I could keep it right there, that would work great. But can't seem to. And no. No. That would look be perfect right there. But no, it's not gonna work. Alright, so let's see here. I'm trying to figure it out, y'all. Wished I could see. God. Trial and error, y'all. Trial and error. Is that gonna work? Ew, it's moving. It's moving. I have to get out to see what y'all are actually looking at. Y'all are looking at nothing but the dash here. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Uh, oh, I got my car running because it's cold outside. And I'm not supposed to work in the garage. I'm trying to be a good girl. Can you see? No. Okay. Hold on. Uh, trying to get this angled up just right for you guys. Uh, okay. work out y'all. Can you see now? Ugh. I'm trying to pick it up in the ah the, the glow compartment thing but really I don't know what you guys are seeing. Huh. I don't know. Ugh. Let me see here. Hold on. I can hold on. Hold on. I don't want you down too far. I really can't see with y'all up there. I can't see what y'all are looking at. Maybe that's working. Maybe it's not. If it is, there'll be a video. If not, there might not be a video. And we got our handy dandy screwdriver. Gonna go to town here. Well, this is awkward to say the least. Usually, I'd just be doing this in my car without recording it, but some people like to see me tear stuff apart, so. Yeah, you gotta do with what you can with the situations you got. You know? So I don't know if these are cast or zinc. Cast aluminum or zinc. I don't know. I just don't know. I thought they were cast, but now I just don't know. Oh. They don't stick to a magnet. That's all I know. Alright, so I'll throw that down there. Start to work on the next one. Oh, there's some yellow string here. Is it yellow? No, it's white. Sorry. Alright. Pull string. These things look kind of new. I mean, the string never was undone, you know? But they were in the trash and the water and stuff. They're dry now, though. I think they got wet. Maybe they didn't get wet, but they were outside for a while. <sighs> Could have been just somebody wealthy enough to have a remote control for it, maybe. I don't know. Things possible, you know. So, and voila. All right, and so let's go ahead and work on this one again. I don't know what you can or cannot see. Just hope for the best.
go ahead and put the video out just so you guys can see what I was attempting to do. I don't know. Let's see. There's, I mean, I got some kind of thing I need to try to set up still. Um. Getting a little hot now. Just sitting here. I do have another one of these I'm going to be working on. So if this one doesn't work out, maybe the next one will. I don't want to be out here all night working on these. I'm kind of tired, actually. Saturday night. Oh, technically it's Sunday morning. It's 12:42 in the morning. Alright, so Sunday morning. Early Sunday morning. Okay. for these last two last bracket fan blade bracket Ooh, the heat's making me tired y'all the weather's making me tired the heat is making me tired and I worked from 3 to 11.30 that's a long shift. And I did take a half hour lunch today. Usually I only get a 15. But yeah, I got my half hour lunch in today. Ugh. Oh, did I? No, I got out at 11, didn't I? Today I got out early. 11. Usually I don't get out till 11.30 or 11.45, but I got out early tonight. So that was good. Uh, Alright, so that is done. Let's get my drink out of the way. Our water. Oh, look, there's a screw right here. So we'll go ahead and undo that one, too. That is for the light fixture here. Seconds. This might have been a good fan. I mean, it looks fairly clean. I mean, somebody decided they didn't want it for whatever reason. Alright, so it's kind of. Oh, there's another screw on the other side. Oh. Oh, there's quite a few screws here, actually. Almost lost my screwdriver, y'all. Oh, there it goes, rolling away from me. Oh, I'm trying to turn this so I can get to the screw. Uh, I'll get to the light switch or fan operation switch this way and that way. Clockwise and counterclockwise switch. I wonder if this switch would work for my my uh, wire stripping machine I'm trying to make. Reverse and forward, huh? Maybe? That's an idea, I guess. So there's the lighting. Alright, it's still got 
some screws here, tiny screws. I don't know if this is coming undone or not. Oh yeah, it is. Okay. Um, yep, yeah, there's one more screw on the other side. I think it was funny. I got some comments from a couple people telling me that I wasted their time for them watching my channel. Eh, don't think I was holding a gun to your head or anything, so you can feel free to not watch the whole channel if you don't want to. So you, your time is not wasted. So a decision is entirely your own. Watch it, don't watch it, is your decision. I'm not going to force anybody to watch something they don't want to watch. So, yeah, don't complain to me if you wasted your own time by watching something you didn't want to watch. Okay. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Alright. So, I just so. Oh. That's a nice little switch there, but, uh, oh, I guess it connects up on the other side. There's so many different wire nuts here, big ones and small ones. I like to keep them because they come in handy. That's the pull string thing to turn a fan off, on high, low, and medium. Oh. oh, I thought that was going to come off. I guess not. Maybe it's on there a different way. Alright, so these, each of these wires here go to each of these sockets here. So, I'll have to work on that some more at another time. Because, yeah, not going to come off easily. I have to take out the screws here. I guess I could go ahead and do that. No problem. good suck up things. Maybe. I don't know. Boo-boo! That's three. One more. I usually break them apart to get the aluminum socket out and the brass pieces out. But I don't know. So all we got left is this here, which probably sticks to the magnet. Yes, it does. Alrighty then. Voila. Alright, so now we're back to the big machine part. We've got this other wire net holding the white wires together. And there you go. I don't know if that's copper or not. It's looking kind of... Kind of silver. It could be... Eh, could be coated wire. I don't know what y'all can see. I'm trying to hold it there for y'all. Alright. Alright. Let's see here. The rest of these wires are crimped on. Yeah. Crimped on. So those would have to be cut off. Huh. What's that? Uh, what is that? Oh. I can take that off, I guess. Yeah. 
Huh, yes. Ba-ba! Brand new, never used. Huh. Okay, let's see here. Got that out, but it's not coming off because it's all crimped together. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, because all that's connected just so. Yeah, I might have to definitely look at this later. Huh? Just so that it can work. Oh, okay, we'll try that off. Oh, it seems to be glued on, yes. Alright, so all this wiring connected together. If I do plan on using that as a reverse switch, I need to keep all that together because there's no way I'm going to remember how to rehook that together. No way. Alright, so now what do I want to do? Any suggestions, y'all? Any suggestions? Is there a nut there? Alright, that's got like one of those special nut things that you need a special tool for that I don't have. Alright, let's look at this other side then. Check that out. It has some screws on there. But I didn't even have to take it off. That held the ball on. Hey. This just has a little dust on it. But yeah, I really don't think this thing got used. I don't think so. Anyhow, do that. I'm going to go ahead and take it apart anyhow. Because I'm not into reselling this at the moment. Maybe whenever I get my own place, I could think about this reselling parts. Stuff is falling off. Ooh, nice. Is it brass? Let's see. No, that sticks to the thing. The magnet. Hmm. Okay, got the little plastic off. Got that off now, and that also sticks to the magnet. So it looks like brass is not brass, it's Magnetized metal stuff. Oh, Carter pin action going on here. I love it. Love that. Let's see. Got that out. Carter pin. Carter pin thingamajiggy. So I'll put that back in there because those are nifty little things to have when you want to not lose something. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six screws to take out right now. So I'm going to work on that. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Got that one loose. I really hope you guys can see some of what I'm working on, but I'm thinking you can't see nothing hardly. Oh, bugger, that's hard. Okay, hold on. Mm. Huh. <sighs> yeah, it would have been nice to try to hook these up to see if they actually worked instead of tearing them apart. I already threw away the fan blade, so... Although, I do got some fan blades in storage that are really nice. Very nice fan blades that have never been used. They're still in the plastic. Mm. Alright. Um, fourth. Wait. Fifth. Or... It is, but it could be wrong. Something's holding it on, that's for certain. I don't know what. 
Can that pop off? Ooh, how does that work? Ooh, I don't know how. Ha <laughs> ha, It. it don't matter. Scrapping it anyhow. Uh-huh. The... Ooh, I got wire with it. <laughs> Copper wire insulated in a piece of metal. Hmm. Ah, I just don't know. I'm going to have to try to get this last screw out. It was giving me a bit of trouble. But maybe... Oh. If I can have it at the right angle, I can get it. Maybe. Ooh. It's really not wanting to work with me, y'all. Oh, well, look at that. It just came right off. That sticks to the magnet. It's pretty heavy, though. It's got some good weight to it. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, Lord. Wow, that is heavy. Ah, it's not cooperating. Alright, y'all, I'm sorry. Y'all can't see what I'm doing, I know. Ah. Oh, come on. Come on. It's getting really hot in here. Ah. Come on, Becca. It's hard to put pressure on it in the seat of my car. Don't want to work. Okay, I'm trying the Phillips screwdriver, but it's not wanting to turn here. Mm. Ah, I can't. No, it's going to strip out. Hold on, let me try to find the other screwdriver. Oh, well. This is still a Phillips screwdriver, but it's a different kind. And it's still not working. Uh, nope, not that one. Try it. Find the flat-handed screwdriver. Ugh. Hmm. Huh? Well, no. Diagonal cutters are not gonna work. Let's see here. Do you got? I got these if all else fails. got these. I'm having a bit of trouble coming across my screwdriver, y'all. Hmm. Alright, sat in the pliers aside. We got the standard... No, oh, that's another Phillips. Where did my standard screwdriver go? That's weird. Alright then, we'll try this one. Another Phillips. Feels like it's got a better grip on it than the other one. Mmm. 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 Then again, maybe not. God, gee, where did the standard screwdriver go? I think it went underneath my seat, y'all. Hold on. y'all. Hmm. That should do the trick, hopefully. Could be wrong. Some of y'all don't care because you can't see what I'm doing. I'm trying so hard. Here we go. Maybe you can see now. I don't know. It's just not uh, cooperating. Cooperate. I'm at a weird angle to boot. That is not working. We're going to try these. These look more formidable. To twist it off. Uh. Mm. Mm. I don't know if that's even turning or not. Or if it's missed. 
Doesn't seem like even these are working. Whoa. This thing is vicious, man. It is not moving. Somebody over torqued this screw on here because it just don't want to budge at all. Oh. No matter what I use, I got the teeth on there, man. Oh. Yeah, that's not budging at all. Oh. Part of me is asking, do I really need to budge this? Because it sure is not moving at all. Huh. would have worked. Huh. It would work if I had use of the bench vice in the house, in the garage. But no. Uh. Okay, y'all. I might have to give up on this for the rest of the night for that piece there because I want to come off. But there's other screws in here, so we'll work on those. At least I can get something undone, maybe. Oh, Lord. Maybe I gotta hold on to it. Oh, man. That's all kinds of moving around. I might not be able to do this, y'all. Huh. Huh. Well, okay then. Be that way. Mm. Nope, the whole thing's moving. Ah. I. No, there's no scrolls there, huh? I don't know. The whole thing is moving. I can't seem to stop it from moving. Oh, it's. I just want the screw to turn. Oh, mercy! Those are torqued on tightly, y'all. Hmm. Ah, hamburger. Mercy. Mercy, mercy. Oh, golly. That way or that way? So. Alright, let's see here. There's one. There's two. And I'm gonna cut the rest of these wires off. So I can figure out what to do with my diagonal cutters here. Oh, here they are. Back where I put them at. Alright. Time to sever the invisible cord on that bigger. Alright, that is done now. I can't get that apart, huh? That is amazing. For real. Everything's on so tight. Can't change nothing. That moves when I try to turn it. Oh, there's no way to hold it still. Hmm. Never had that happen before. I've taken these apart before, but I've never had that happen. I guess it would hold on that. Does it still turn? Yeah, it still turns. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Craft made. It's a craft made uh, fan. Huh. Huh. Wow. I still can't believe I can't get these screws out. Alright, you guys, I guess the video is coming to an end because I can't do any more. Oh, wait, it's turning. Yes. Finally. Oh, it was turning. It was. Ah, oh, stopped. I spoke too soon. Ah, oh, the struggle is real. Oh, God. When you're in a car working, the struggle is real. Real. That one, nope, that is not working. The other one would work better. Right, let's try it again. Ugh, man, it's like really, really torqued in there. Alright, turned a little more. Ah, oh, bigger. Oh, God. Alright, let's try one more. Phillips screwdriver is a different one. I got it to turn a little bit here and there. Alright. Mercy six alive. Is that moving? It's moving again, y'all. Yes. Yes. Oh my god, yes. 
It's free. Just about it. Oh my goodness. Maybe it was glued in there? I really think it was ever torqued in there, but maybe just glued. Oh my gosh. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah. Oh, Lord, mercy. Ugh. It's out. Whether y'all saw me get it out or not, it is out. And it's still not coming off. Ha! Huh. Well, for real, I don't know how to get that off. I don't know if I could get the flat standard screwdriver in there and pry it apart or not. I hurt myself, y'all. Hmm. Because I can't hold it and use a hammer and stuff. Yeah. Alright, y'all. That's as far as I can get. Literally, physically. Everything. Yeah. That's it. That's all I could get done. Sad but true. I'm going to have to invest in a vice. Maybe I'll get one for my birthday knows I don't know but that is that and I shall put this away and I appreciate you guys watching even though you may not could see anything you try to watch you saw my struggle was real I gotta put my trash away all right and my seats all dirty there I did that on my leather seat. Can you believe that crap? Oh. It's a leather seat. Uh, it's probably fake leather, actually. It's from Walmart. It's probably PVC leather. Leather. Whatever you want to call it. Leather? Is that what you call it? Leather? Fake leather? I don't know. It looks okay. Alrighty then, y'all. Thanks for watching. Go Boolean Treasures! Ooh, don't forget to smash that like button, share with your family, friends, and co-workers and strangers. Leave a comment, and I will comment back as soon as possible. Subscribe for more, and don't forget, ring that notification bell. Bye!